Dinosaur King, King is what, what you want to be. be. Yeah. Yes, welcome back to Dinosaur King in Jurassic World Evolution episode 6 of Maximus vs. Chomp. As you can see, we are back with the arena and on the left side we have the Space Pirates Lab which will have a Maximus of the 1993 model of Triceratops of Jurassic World Evolution and on the right side we of course have the D-Lab with Chomp. So before we get into this amazing battle, please consider heading over to my merch page tspring.com slash store slash lpgolzy for the new Terry Neon merch. It's amazing. My will arrive in a couple of days and use the code Terry for 20% off. Plus the memberships have finally been returned to my channel. So go down in the description box below. You'll see a join membership link and you can view all the perks that come with it for only one dollar per month i can do it with my fingers almost one dollar yeah no what i almost got it <laughs> it's difficult still learning one dollar there we go we got one dollar per month and you can get early access to videos and live streams get emojis and badges next to your name go check it out it's got some good stuff over there so as some of you know this might not be what you expected because on the episode six skin poll that I put up on Paul Unit. I also leave a link for that in the description box below so you can vote what skin you would like to see in episode 7. 25 votes were on the Carcharodontosaurus skin from Dinosaur King but I was like I, I kinda want to have Maximus for this episode and next episode we will have Carcharodontosaurus battle against whom? You can decide. Go in the link. It will take you to this website, Poor Unit. You can vote on which skin you would like to see battle Carcharodontosaurus. Of course, this would be a bit tricky, kind of similar to the Paris versus Tank episode three, because these are two herbivores and they can't really battle against each other. But if there are too many of the same species in one enclosure, so I guess we'd have to have like 20 Triceratops before they actually fight each other for dominance and. And yet again, in the end, they won't fully actually finish each other off. Like a T-Rex versus a Triceratops, it's not the same. So, of course, in the background, we will have Ace's help for this episode from the D-Lab. But Maximus can still win because this is a normal Triceratops right here. But the second one will be a high modified Maximus and Chomp. So yeah, to make it even, we have a Ace battling Gygus from the other episode. Now, of course, I'm going to release Chomp first, and what do we say? Yes, Dino Slash. You are beautiful as always. Welcome back, Jump. We even got the rainbow effects at the top. So glad we have you back. Hey, even for me, I'm Terry, your arch enemy, and I'm <laughs> I even say welcome back, so that's uh, something big coming from me. So yeah, this is a normal genomed Jump, and this will hopefully battle against a Maximus. And what does, well, the Maximus belongs to Sheer. What does Sheer say? Something Maximus. I need to really look that up. I need to look that up. Anyways, sheer slash, I don't know. <laughs> And perfect timing with the ray for an extra dramatic effect. Now, some of you know I actually created this skin yesterday in a live stream that I have been doing lately. So make sure you join those live streams. And I will be doing a members only live stream. Now, one thing that's a pity is the Jurassic World Evolution models. Of course, the Triceratops in Dinosaur King, those models are a bit slimmer. But aside from that, the logo worked, the orange worked, and the white around it 
this is a beautiful skin if I do say so myself. I like the crest too, this is so cool. And I really hope we can add some spectral armor in a new by future to make these dinosaurs even more amazing. Good luck against Chomp and um, who will win? Oh, they're already walking towards each other. I don't know if it's gonna be a battle or just to greet each other. <laughs> but even from the front, look at this, you are a beauty. Because this was one of the most uh, trickiest skins to make because there weren't many screenshots of Maximus, especially from the back and how this all went in the flow and I kind of improvised, but I did my best in trying to make it as similar as the original and I think it turned out pretty well. Yeah, there it is. Oh, it's actually gonna run. Oh, <laughs> are you going to battle? That's the question. Do I even have battles enabled? That's my question. Turns out I did not have battles enabled, but maybe they are going to battle. Who knows? Not too sure though, but they're just going to communicate first. Look at that. This is beautiful too. Who will win? Cast your votes in the comments. Chomp versus Maximus. So without further ado, let's release the other Chomp and Maximus as well to get a party of four. And maybe, just maybe, they're going to battle. Who knows? I don't think four is enough. And if it's not, we will release Ace and Gigas. So there you go, that's a second chump, a stronger chump, and now an even stronger Maximus will be released. This might come to a surprise, but this orange color is not actually the original pattern. This is the 1993C pattern to make the orange look best, and they're actually going to fight, but against the wrong! <laughs> Type your de- <laughs> Oh, finally a battle takes place, and it's Maximus versus Maximus. But, um, who will win? <laughs> I think the stronger Maximus will win. Yeah, and that's the battle. That's what I was talking about. They're already gonna back off. They didn't even do anything. Now, I gotta say, that was the most epic battle I've ever seen in my entire life. Especially that horn hitting. Oh, I loved it. <laughs> Dinosaur King Season 3 Plot Twist. Chomp actually teams up with Maximus. Does that mean the D-Team actually collected Maximus's card from Sheer? What is happening? They're even morphing with each other. This is Season 4 stuff. Look at that. Two Triceratops hybrid. What is going on? This chump will go to sleep while Maximus is trying to find a uh, search for an old lady. You better not be talking about me when you use a word like that, you juvenile delinquent! So yeah, nothing further is happening, so I think I actually have to release Ace and Gigas. So yeah, here we go. Ace joins the lobby. Ace and Gigas both do not have any modifications enabled, so um, I think it's gonna be a pretty fair fight. And Ace just is just going for it. It's like, <laughs> get away from Chomp. Never mind, it's under control. U turn, other way. I just saw there are four Triceratops. I'm gonna just head on the other way. So here we go. We're gonna add the Gigas. And so this one will go straight towards the Triceratops. Ace, what are you doing targeting Chomp? Ace is gonna lose! What? Why? <laughs> Chomp, Ace was there to... Whoa, Chomp is under mind control. Epic new plus twist season three. What? Or Sheer captured Chomp's card and fought against Ace while Ace got defeated. What is happening? Even Gigas is backing down. This episode is just all over the place. Dinosaurs are not fighting the dinosaurs that they are meant to fight. Gigas is now battling Ace. What is happening? That's good. Back down and run towards Chomp for help. And once again, the rain is being called The Thunder by Maximus and Chomp, and I guess Kygus is going to battle Maximus. At least we're seeing a fight against the Triceratops. One hit? Kygus goes down in one- Nah, that can't be. And uh, there we go. I guess. And then we have Ace battling Chomp. Gigas should have battled Chomp again in one hit. Ace goes down in one hit too. Yeah. 
These Triceratops are overpowered. They only have three attack modifications I could add on them. They're dominating the carnivorous dinosaurs. Wait, who wins now? I don't know. Is it <laughs> Maximus that one or is it Chump? I think I will conclude it into a draw. It's a pity that these uh, couldn't really uh, fight against each other. Ace is back and got the healing powers from Paris and Gigas too. And Ace is actually going to challenge the right team this time. And that is Maximus. Who is going to win? Ace or Maximus? We just have to picture Chomp here. Ace going for the first bite, the Cyclone. What is Maximus going to do? A nice headbutt. That leaves Ace damaged a lot. And Ace backs down. 1-0 for Maximus. Chomp has to win this one to make it 1-1. Otherwise, the Space Pirates actually win. Chomp makes the first move. Gigas going to activate Spectral Lancer sooner or later. Watch out for that, Chomp. That's a pretty powerful attack. And there it is. And Chomp officially backs down. Episode 6 goes to the Space Space Pirates, are you <laughs> serious? They actually won. And because Chomp lost, there is the card. And that's going to conclude this episode of Dinosaur King and Jurassic World Evolution. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to get Terry Merced 20% off. Link will be in the description box below. Plus, you can find, of course, the membership link in the description box below to join for only $1 per month. And you can get access to unreleased footage and a sneak peek of the newest battle, Episode 7. Don't forget to vote with the poll unit. With that being said, I'll up with Brendan. I'll sorry, lovely T-Rex members in the next episode. Goodbye, T-Rexes. Alpha Terry, out. Jurassic World, the game is Dinosaur King, episode 7 of the unreleased season 3. You might as well call it like that, yeah. <laughs> we are back with a battle between the Space Pirate Stegosaurus, aka Armata skin, versus the episode 3 star tank of the Alpha Gang, which is disguised as a Cyclania, which is disguised in, in Jurassic World Evolution as an Eophocephalus. And because herbivores can't really battle against each other, the Alpha Gang will have Spiny on its team, and the Space Pirates will have the old Gigas on their team. So who's going to win? Let me know down in the comments box below, and vote for episode 9. The vote of the poor unit link will be in the description box below, and as a pinned comment in the comment section below, you can vote on what skin you would like to see battle against Carcharodontosaurus. Is it going to be Sorophagnax? Is it going to be any other dinosaur? Let me know. Yes, we skipped an episode. This is episode 7, and you have to vote for episode 9. Gozi, why not episode 8? Because episode 8 is going to have Terry versus the Black T-Rex and after that the Carcharodontosaurus is going to battle well let me know with the voting of course so yeah with that being said get your neon terry merch in the description box below teespring.com slash store slash lp and use the code terry for 20 percent off and become a member for only one dollar per month so you can have early access to videos sneak peeks emojis badges next to your name it's great go check it out link for that will also be in the description box below so without further ado, we are going to release Tank the Saichenia in this one. Of course, the first one does not have any modifications attached to Tank, but the second Tank, as you can see, is a lot stronger with, of course, releasing the Spinosaurus. The first Spinosaurus does not have any modification, but the second one has. The same goes for Armitus and Gigas. So yeah, with that being said, Alpha Slash!
is. Yes, the beauty tank. I have missed you. And gosh, you look great today. Oh, that camera angle just went. <laughs> so tank is slowly making her way into the battle arena of Dr. Z. And I'm surprised that we haven't seen any old ladies yet. <laughs> It's very hard for me to be nice! Calm down, remember your breathing exercises! Alright, never mind, back to tank! You are a beauty tank. Of course, we're going to straight off release the other one because we would like to see a battle start ASAP. Now, going over to the Space Pirates Lab, we have a new skin and it's going to be the 1997 Pattern A Stegosaurus. I had some difficulties, like always, with the first pattern, so this pattern is actually the best to release Armatus in. I do not know what full scap says, but um, here we go, Armatus Slash. <laughs> Timing again with the rain for an extra dramatic effect. The space parts have joined the arena and look at you. You are a pretty cool skin. It looks like a milk chocolate stegosaurus. That's what it looks like <laughs> instead of an armatus. I don't know, this is a weird stegosaurus uh, skin, but it's cool nonetheless. We might as well release the other one too. Come on out, Armatus 2.0. The stronger one. So are the space pirates going to take this W again just like last time or are they going to fail against the Alpha Gang? With that being said, of course we need to have a battle right now. So Spiny is going to be released. So here we go. We have Spiny. It's been a while and there we go. A match already starts. This is what I wanted to see. So the first battle has started and who's going to win? Spiny versus Arms. So Spiny is of course representing Tank. Ouch. I do not know if this is the first Armatus or the second one. We will soon find out I guess. What are Spiny's moves? Oh boy, I don't know. <laughs> um, use... Tilt Smash! No, not Stick! <laughs> I meant Spiny! Spiny lost! What is going on? Oh! Ouch! There goes Spiny, I guess. In the death pose, too! <laughs> oh my word! Armatist is no joke! Look at Spiny absolutely wrecked! Okay, next battle is going to be Geigers. Let's see if Tank can um, actually win against Geigers then. Welcome back, Geigers. I've been using you for the past two episodes. I think you're just a killer. Literally. <laughs> so, you've chosen an enemy. Okay, there we go. Sarchania versus Geigers, the Geigasaurus. So, who's going to win this one? Is Tank going to triumph or is the Geigas too strong for Tank to handle? We'll soon find out when Tank is ready. Take your time, Tank. <laughs> Here he goes. Intimidation War, you gotta watch out for that Spectral Lancer. But I think Tank actually stole that move because that was beautiful. And another one from Tank. I wanted to say Gygas. And Gygas goes down. What is going on with the carnivorous dinosaurs losing? That's a total knockout. What just... <laughs> what is happening? And in the death post to a perfect dip. Look at that. What is going on? Literally. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to release the stronger Gygas and stronger Spiny. We're actually going to remove these, otherwise um, they're going to eat from these uh, corpses. So here it goes. The stronger Spiny with some modifications. Hopefully this one can take down an Armatus. And of course I'm going to release a stronger Gygas. So who's going to win this second round? Cast your vote. Spiny is really upset that the previous Spiny lost. That roar. I failed that. And Spiny is just making its way to the Armatus for revenge. 
and the Armatus, the Alpha one, actually flees away. They're both scared of the stronger Spiny. And, uh, there it goes, the Alpha? No, it's not the Alpha tank. Okay. First bite from Gygus. I think, yeah, yeah. I th do think Gygus is going to win this one, though. Oh, boy, look at that. Full of rage. And then we have Tank. <laughs> Come on, Tank. Show them who's boss. And in the background, we have Spiny versus Armatus. This is a beautiful view right here. Oh boy. Who's going to take the win? Both dinosaur battles are waiting. Who's going to swing first? Tank, you small attack. It did not work. And there it goes. Tank will go down along with Armatus. And there goes Armatus. Oh boy, Gygus. Okay, well, we know now. There it goes. The second round actually goes to both. It's still a tie. And Gygus is gonna have a little snack of Tank. Poor Tank. We, of course, see the card right there. It's called back. But we have one Tank remaining. And, of course, that same goes for this Armatus. The card is right there. Poor Armatus. Can't believe it. Spiny and Gygus are going for a sleep. Even Armatus is taking a little nap. <laughs> it's been a long day of running away. Armatus is ready for a battle. You look amazing, Armatus. You still look awesome. Gygus is getting ready. And this Sychenia has got fire in her eyes. Well, Spiny spectates in the background. But I think uh, Spiny is going to run over to the Armatus right there. First one, Spectral Lancer by Gygus. Another one, it's over. It's already over. That lasted two seconds. I swear I did not go overboard with the modifications. I just put three. Even this one had more modifications attached to it than a T-Rex. Tank lost again. Oh boy, if the Armatus loses this one, then it all comes down to Spiny versus Gygus. Armatus, when you win this, the Space Pirates have officially won. You Spectral Punisher, that is Armatus' signature move. And Armatus has lost! I guess the uh, the main dinosaurs for this episode have been literally knocked out and we are left with Gygus versus Spiny. <laughs> Gygus is like, wait up! <laughs> I need to tell you something. Well, tell him quick because uh, he's, uh, Spiny's thinking about his victory for too long. And the rain has been set and this gives Spiny the water advantage. And there it goes. He used water sword. Can Gygus use a special answer? This is the final battle. Who will win this one? This one determines everything. Gygus is not looking so good. Will the Alpha again finally win an episode? Come on, Spiny, you got this. Gygus goes in with a special answer, does a lot of damage. Another one. Oh my word, and Spiny backs down. That means the Space Pirates have officially won. Spiny, I expected more from you. If you're going into dying mode, it's officially over. It says dying, there we go. So the Space Pirates have won again. But this one, oh, you're going into game ended mode too, but with 30% health and 28. Do I have to seriously weigh and which one will die faster? I think it's the same speed. I think it's the same die speed. So in the end, Gygus is still the winner. With that being said, of course, vote for a dinosaur in the description box below with the poll unit website. And don't forget to get your Terry merch and use the code Terry for 20% off and become a member for only $1 per month. You can get early access to these Dinosaur Kingdom these Jurassic World videos and get like special emojis to use in these premieres because this is a premiere right now. It's got some cool stuff. So yeah, that will also be in the description box below. With that being said, I'll have a great day and I'll see you lovely T-Rex members in the next Dinosaur King episode. Goodbye, Rexes. Alpha Terry. Out.
what you wanna be. Yes, welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution meets Dinosaur King episode. Eight. Yes, welcome back. Today we have me, aka Terry the Tyrannosaurus Rex, fighting against another Tyrannosaurus Rex, but not just some ordinary one. It is the Black T-Rex, made by Seth. And some of you may remember this is the strongest and biggest T-Rex ever in Dinosaur King. But before we get into the battle, please check out merch teespring.com slash store slash LPGOLS and use the code Terry for 20% off is in the description box below. Get your neon Terry merch. Black T-Rex merch incoming? Hmm? So of course in this Hammond Creation Lab we have the Alpha Gangs Terry. First T-Rex is of course without any modifications in genomes, but the second one actually has has some while well, on the other side where we have Seth's Hammond creation lab we have the black Xerox without any genomes but the second one is overpowered will Terry beat black T-Rex let me know in the comments box below who are you rooting for just like we always do we start with this side while we open up the gate and what do we say alpha slash Terry was like, hello, are you out there, old lady? No, I'm not an old lady! So yeah, welcome back, Terry. You look amazing as always. Last time you actually battled the Gigasaurus from Gabra from the Space Pirates. Go watch that episode if you have not already. And now you're fighting the strongest T-Rex ever. How do you feel? I am so pumped, let's get right into the battle. So, on this one, we're of course gonna open up the gate too. And I know exactly what Seth says. Here we go. Let's see if I can do it in the same kind of tone. Okay, here we go. Rise, Black T-Rex! is a real black T-Rex, ladies and gentlemen. The black T-Rex is going straight for Terry, but before we get into this battle, look at that, Terry is, oh my word, Terry looks scared. <laughs> Look at this devil of a T-Rex. You look amazing. I am so happy with this skin. The patterns look great. Some of you may remember from the live stream I did where I made this skin that I tried to recreate a flowing effect, especially on the top that the black T-Rex in the anime has because it has like magma or lava flowing through its body. But in Jurassic World Evolution, it doesn't really work that way. This fight you're about to see is the most requested battle I've ever received in these episodes and what you're about to witness is pure awesomeness so yeah here we go no <laughs> um black t-rex is slowly walking away I was like <laughs> Terry's not worth it and Terry's not having it look at that Terry's like wait a minute you come back here now black t-rex is like what do you want you want a battle you're gonna get one. Here we go. Volcano burst! Terry goes with the volcano burst. What's this? No offense? Can this black T-Rex use fire scorcher? But Terry's not backing down. This is a good Terry. Let's go! <laughs> fire scorcher! Whoa! 
will the Black Hero strike back? And yes, it will. Who's going to win this one? Terry is backing down 1-0 for the Black T-Rex. <laughs> Bunch of cowards! While well, the Black T-Rex walks away victorious. And Terry is going for a little sleep, or Terry is going into dying mode, which I hope he is not. No, he's just sleeping. Okay, then it's all good. That actually sounded like the Black T-Rex. Plus, Terry's back awake. What? Terry's going back to sleep? What? Terry literally just woke up. Is Terry going into real dying mode now? He is good. He stood up from his sleep and went back down to go. <laughs> I think that roar woke up Terry and then was like, all right, I'm gonna head out. I hope this black T-Rex does not break out and destroy cities just like in the anime. This is not in the anime. This is not kid friendly. God, I can't look. Well, you didn't see that in the anime. That was a deleted scene right there. <laughs> to make it fair, I incubated another Terry, but the stronger Terry is going to be released first. Here we go again, Alpha Slash. It's gotta be a stronger roar, let me hear it. Oh yeah, that's definitely a stronger one. And like always, Seth stabs us in the back and is going to release a much stronger Black T-Rex with more power he generated. Rise once again, Black T-Rex. And this is the ultimate Black T-Rex. And this Black T-Rex is mocking Terry. Wow, <laughs> the exact same scenarios. All right, while he's sleeping, I'm going to release the other Terry. So it's 2v1 giving Terry a much more fair chance in winning. <laughs> Terry's just looking at Black T-Rex like, are you, gonna, are you gonna fight or what? I'm ready. Black T-Rex is like, yeah, hold on. All right, you called in another one. That's it. I'm gonna take you down first. And here we go. Terry versus Black T-Rex. Terry's gotta use ultimate fire for sure. Oh wait, that did not exist yet. <laughs> oh no. Watch out for this black T-Rex. It's got fire scorcher. Terry counters it with a volcano burst, but no. That was fire scorcher by black T-Rex. Who will win? Oh no. Another fire scorcher. It's done. It cannot be defeated. This black T-Rex is overpowered. And as you can see right there is the card for Terry. Defeated by the black T-Rex. Well, that is new. The Black T-Rex has taken a quick snap from Terry. Okay. These episodes are a lot darker than I remember. <laughs> and then we have Terry saying, Oi, wait, that's illegal. Will this Terry take on the Black T-Rex? Will it even stand a chance? That's a better question. But the Black T-Rex is not done yet. The Black T-Rex will not rest until he has defeated every Terry that exists. He is going full out, Terry, come on! This is an awesome view, oh my word. Use Fire Scorcher, and there he goes. Terry, once again, goes down. Wow. Black T-Rex is mucking the Terrys. What can defeat this Black T-Rex? Poor Terry. That's going to conclude this episode of Jurassic World Evolution meets a Dinosaur King. Let me know what other skin you would like to see. Next time, it's going to be Kakarotosaurus versus Sorophaganax. So make sure you subscribe and notification on so you get notified for that battle. After that, there's going to be a giant battle royale of Black T-Rex, Terry, Spiny, Tank, Chomp, Ace, and Paris with Gygas, Artemis, and Maximus 
all together is going to be huge so you definitely do not want to miss that next time with that being said get your terry merch at teespring.com slash store slash lp because they use the code terry for 20 percent off and become a member for early access sneak peeks of these battles with that being said hope everyone's gonna have a great day and i'll see all you lovely t-rex members in the next episode goodbye rexes alpha tyrannosaurus out You wanna, you wanna be? be yeah. Yes, welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution meets Dinosaur King episode 9. Welcome back at the Dr. Z arena where we have in the Seth lab the Sorophagonax plus the Cochrodontosaurus at the D team. But before we get into those battles, get your Terry merch at teespring.com slash door slash LP because if you want to support me in the series and use the code Terry for 20 present off there we go got the fingers done that <laughs> and become a member for only one dollar per month to get early access to sneak peeks of skins that i for example created for the next couple of episodes and a new poor has gone up on poor unit the link for that will also be in the description box below where you can vote which dinosaur you'd like to see in the next episode with that being said yes of course we're first going to release the carcarodontosaurus from dinosaur king and after that the Sorophagonax from Seth. Now, in the last episode, Seth incubated and released a black T Rex that fought against me, Terry. But if you have not seen that episode, go watch that right now and then return back to this one. But if you have, so without further ado, oh, well, I almost released the Seth one first. Well, no, we're going to release the Cochrodontosaurus one first. Now, as always, the first Cochrodontosaurus dinosaur will not have any modifications, but the second one, however, will have a maximum. Same goes for Seth Sora Fagnax. The first one does not have any, but the second one, however, will have one. Will Seth take the win? Let me know who you are rooting for, and with that being said, we always say, let's go, Dino Slash! <laughs> we go. This is Dinosaur King's Cochrodontosaurus in Jurassic World Evolution. Now this skin is made by Stranger Gamer and the model was made by Dino Nerd. You guys have done an amazing job on this one. Bit of the model edits there because I'm not really as usual <laughs> a total fan of Jurassic World Evolution's dinosaur model for the Cochrodontosaurus in this case. And one of those changes is actually the spike removal on its back to its tail. You guys did an amazing job. Now this Cochrodontosaurus is looking for a fight and I believe I know what Seth says in the anime. If you want to fight, you'll get one. Here we go. <laughs> Thoro Faganax! Here we go. A beautiful Thoro Faganax charging <laughs> towards the Cochrodontosaurus in one straight line. Well, before you get into a battle, I want to check out the skin for you too. I absolutely love the Thoro Faganax and Dinosaur skin. Look at that, we got the head details there, the beautiful green eye, and then the red with the whitish that's as a line going over the black and the stuff like that. It's very cool, and it is going to fight against the Cochrodontosaurus. A lot of you actually wanted to see this fight, so yeah, here we go. And the Cochrodontosaurus is also charging towards the Sorophagonax and synchronize the sleeping. <laughs> it's a thing nowadays, I don't know. <laughs> but they charge towards each other and then they just get bored of each other one second after I don't know they just go straight to sleep will they wake up synchronized too that's the that's the question here who will wake up first cast your votes this is the real blockbuster folks and it is the Sorophagonax yes take your time take yeah 
I swear, Sword Fact Nexus, you're not even gonna battle. Okay, they're going into battle. Let's go. Behold, Fire Scorcher! Sword Fagnax versus Carter and Daltasaurus. And the Sword of Fagnax actually used Fire Scorcher. What? It still has that move. And the Carter and Daltasaurus used a Fire Cannon move. A quick snap from the Sword of Fagnax. Let's get a sky view just like the sleeping one. And the Carcadontosaurus is backing down. That leaves 1-0 to the Soro Fagnax. Oh, they haven't had enough. That is the quickest rematch I've ever seen. What are you guys doing? Carcadontosaurus is uh, usually looking for the old lady. Would you please stop calling me that? Sometimes that's used as a term of respect. Respect this! <laughs> so is Soro Fagnax. Look at this. They've become friends! Look at that! They had a quick brawl and were like, nah, you're cool, dude. Now, I am sorry, but that is against the Dinosaur King Arena laws. I didn't invent them, they're Dr. Z's rules, and what Dr. Z would want to say is release the other stronger Carcharodontosaurus, which will hopefully take down a Sorofagonax. There we go. I like the roar too. Now, of course, then I'd have to release the what? The Sorofagnax is asleep. <laughs> Again, hopefully you guys won't battle each other. Oh, it's the Alpha. Of course, of course. Now, that means I have to release the Alpha Sorofagnax as well to make it equal. Here we go. What happened? What? I released the Sorofagnax and now the Sorofagnax. What? They teamed up against Seth Sorofagonax. Oh, this Sorofagonax has had it. And yeah, it's because you guys go to sleep every time. <laughs> Even that Sorofagonax is like... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Why are you going to sleep now? He is like, sorry, I didn't do it. The Alpha did it. It's true. The Alpha actually took down this Sorofagonax, right? TS6, yeah. Can this Sorofagonax take down... Two Cockroodontosaurus. Now, would you look at that? The Sorofagonax has been returned to its card. Poor Sorofagonax. And hopefully, you win in the next battle, which is, I believe, going to start in a minute. Yeah, there we go. So, this is the normal Cockroodontosaurus with less than 50 health versus the Alpha Sorofagonax. And I believe this sort of fag max is going to use magma blaster. And there we go. And again, it is unstoppable. Even Spiny didn't stand a chance. Let's see this. Oh boy, here it comes. Yep, it was that easy. Two Magna Blasters versus the Carcharodontosaurus. It's over. Oh, now the other one is taking a sleep. What's all with these dinosaurs taking a sleep nowadays? <laughs> oh, boy. As you can see right there, there's a Carcharodontosaurus' card. Well, that was an awesome shot, though. Well, the Sorofagnax... Oh, it's picking up Carcharodontosaurus' scent. And I believe, yep, yeah, is going to charge towards the Carcharodontosaurus with full speed. And it's going to sleep again! <laughs> they charge towards each other, thinking, I'm... okay, here comes an epic battle. Well, uh, no, you just... <laughs> what is this? You do look awesome, though. Are you going to sleep or are you really going to battle? They are really going to battle. All right, let's see if for real season now. The strongest Carcadontosaurus versus the strongest Alpha Sorofagonax. Will this Carcadontosaurus win? Oh, the Sorofagonax is going for it. You have to act now. There we go. A beautiful fire cannon, finally. And another hit from Sorofagonax. And 
And there it goes. Bone crushing. Well, well, well. It is Seth who takes the W and the Sorrow Faganax wins. <laughs> That concludes this episode of Dinosaur King in Jurassic World Evolution. Let me know what kind of battle you'd like to see in the next episode with the poor unit, of course, link down below. Become a member for only $1 per month to get early access to these videos and get early sneak peeks of new skins that I am creating for these episodes. Get your merch at teespring.com slash store slash LP Use the code tear for 20% off. Maybe we can even get Sora Fagonite merch Ooh, or Carcarandaltosaurus merch. So with that being said, hope everyone's going to have a great day and also all you lovely T-Rex members in the next episode. Goodbye Rexes, Alpha Terry, out. <laughs> Last time on Dinosaur King. Chomp, Ace, and Paris were facing off against Terry, Spiny Tank, and the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus to get the Carcarodontosaurus card. And it didn't take long for the Space Pirates to return either with their Gigas Maximus and Malmatus. Along with that, Seth decided to join in with his Sora Faganax and Black T Rex. Can you guess which new dinosaur will appear in this episode? King is what you wanna be. Yes, welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution meets Dinosaur King episode 12, where all the dinosaurs will face off each other in a battle royale. So yeah, before we get into this episode, please check out merch teespring.com slash store slash LP Gossip. We have some new merch, yes, and use the code Terry for 20% off. As you can see right here, we have a couple of enclosures. Now, if you watched the previous episodes, you will recognize all the skins here we have chomp along with ace in this enclosure and of course paris welcome back and in this one we have the carcarodontosaurus from the last episode followed up by seth Sorafagnax and black t-rex in this one and of course in the alpha gang enclosure we have terry me and spiny with tank and last but not least, in the final enclosure, we have the Space Pirates, where we have Maximus, Gygus, and Armatus. And they will all face each other off in this arena you see right here. Now let me know with a comment down below, who do you think will win in this episode, and let me know what kind of skin you would like to see in episode 13 with the pool unit link also in the description box below. With that being said, yes, I will transport all of them into Dr. Z's arena, where I will be making his dinosaur or kingdom dream complete. You'll take care of that, right, Ed? Remind me again how that's spelled. It's Dr. Z! You spell it with a Z! So we will return them back into cars and Dino slash them into this arena. Yeah! Here goes Dino Slash! Dino Slash! Help us slash! Every dinosaur is on its max genome, and as you can see, they're being transported right into the arena, and uh, oh! There's the Alpha Acro. Okay, I actually forgot about you. I totally forgot to mention you. Hello, there's just too many dinosaurs. Can't keep up. Of course, you're looking for the old lady here. <gasps> I don't ever want to hear those words again. I am not an old lady. I am a budding young girl. Hey, you who are you talking to, Ursula? But that's okay. Go back to sleep. That's what every other dinosaur does in these episodes. <laughs> Finally, every dinosaur has been sent into the arena. Now, I'm going to put on combat frequency on maximum in a minute, but I I just want to enjoy this view. Look at it, they're all in the arena. They look so cool together too. They're so peaceful with one another. Now let's just hope Spiny doesn't, of course, battle Terry because we have teams of Alpha Gang versus Seth versus D teams versus Space Pirates and so on. Now with all that roaring, they're really telling me to put it on. So yeah, are you ready? Here we go. As for right now, dinosaur combat frequency is on. So who will battle who? probably cannot even keep up with all the battles that are gonna take place. I did put you on single species, so I don't know why you're- Oh, <laughs> there we go. This is what I wanted to see. This is going to be Ace versus Gygus. And, oh my word, of course, the Black T-Rex. Will Black T-Rex defeat them all? Black T-Rex is the strongest dinosaur in the arena. 
of course. Let's see the battle. Spare no expense. Here we go. Oh boy, with all the roaring. This is the only fight going on. No, Sorrow Fagnax is gonna take on Spiny. And the Alpha Acro is gonna take on the Armatus. Oh my word. And the Black Turks is gonna fight Kakarodontosaurus. The best view is from this side. Look at this. Who will win? Who will... Oh, okay. Geig is backed off. But of course, they need to finish off each other to get the full win. We will not work with a score here because I will not be able to keep up. But Spiny backs up from Sorrow Fagnax. And Ace is not done. Ace is like, I still want a piece of you. Ooh, will the Karkaradontosaurus win? Probably not though. But it's cool seeing all the dinosaurs in one arena. And sadly, the Karkaradontosaurus is going to go out first. Oh no, actually I see Armatus uh, not living in the background. And Tank! So Karkaradontosaurus has been eliminated along with Armatus by the Alpha Acro. And what tank has been defeated by Terry? <laughs> I forgot to disable team damage. And as we see right here, Paris's healing jump. Oh, wait, what? They're getting ready for a battle. What? I was like, what? <laughs> Paris has the battling animation now? <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, uh, yeah, here it comes. I can already see it in the background. Paris was a beautiful nature's blessing. Before getting taken out by Sensoro Fagonax. It healed Ace just in time when battling Maximus. And it didn't help! And there it goes, Ace. Oh, and we have Black T-Rex going to battle against the Chomp. Oh my word, there's a battle happening every second. Of course, there are no breaks in a battle royale. Every dino for him or herself. And in the background, we have Terry still in the game! Yes! Versus Soro Fagnax. Of course, Chomp, you have to work with your team. But it's done for Chomp because Ace and Pass are already out. So, yep. There we go. And Soro Fagnax loses by Terry. I want to see this in slow motion. Here we go. Yes. The Soro Fagnax is very strong. But it cannot compete against Terry. The beautiful Tyrannosaurus. <laughs> that sounds so cool. Now give me a head count. Who do we have left? We have Terry, Alpha Acro, I think Gygus is just sleeping, yeah? And the Black T-Rex. Oh, and we have Spiny. And there goes Maximus by the Alpha Acro out of the blue while Terry is fighting Spiny in the background. And I think... The Black Tyrus is going to take on Geiger as well. <laughs> if only we saw that in the anime. What is this? A new dinosaur has appeared. The Allosaurus. This is the secret dinosaur. First, it's going to take a quick snack of Maximus, though, before it's going to battle, apparently. As from the live stream where we created this skin, the Allosaurus wasn't going to make an appearance until episode 13, where it's going to battle, what, Ace? Now, Gygus is going to take on the Black T-Rex. Gygus is very strong, but of course, as we can remember, the Black T-Rex might be stronger. And as expected, Gygus will go down. One down, three to go. And the Allosaurus is going to battle the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. Now, wind isn't very good against fire. Maybe it stands a chance? Who knows? Come on, you got this. Allosaurus does a beautiful Mayfly move. And it actually takes down Alpha Acro. It is the rain. 
It's the water that's helping it! Mayfly with water! It's like Ace using Cyclone, but with water. Wow, what a move! It remembers from Ace and it took down the Alpha Acro. <laughs> wow, that is actually phenomenal. And to mock it even more, it's gonna sleep next to it. While we have Terry remaining and the Black T-Rex. While the other dinosaurs have been safely returned into cars. Now this is the battle that I've been waiting for. Yeah! yeah! Show, Show that, that T-Rex what you got, got Terry! Here <laughs> we go. Come on, Terry, take down the black T-Rex. You got this one. Can Terry do it? Let's get a beautiful view on that. It just volcano burst. But it's not enough. May the black T-Rex just fire scorcher. No! Terry takes down black T-Rex! It's done! It actually did it! This is historical! What? Let's go! <laughs> GG in chat right now! Terry wins! Oh my word! You saw it here! Terry takes down Black Turks and <laughs> making its way towards the Allosaurus who took down Spiny in the meantime. We didn't see that, but um, I would rather see Terry take down Black T-Rex. Wow, that is like, I'm shaking. This is, what, <laughs> this is a whole new way of seeing these dinosaurs fight. It's amazing. Unbelievable. The Black T-Rex took down three dinosaurs though. I think it had the most kills, but this is the final battle because it will all come down to these two, Allosaurus, versus Terry. Let's see it. Who's going to win the final battle? Terry does another beautiful volcano burst and it's done! Allosaurus will go down! From all the dinosaurs, Terry is the winner. Winner, winner, dino dinner. Terry's like, all right, that's enough. I'll go for a quick nap now. And Terry has beaten the Black Tears in getting the most dinosaur kills with an impressive four. He took down four and was the last dinosaur standing. Wow. What? This was mayhem of a match. This was beautiful. Now, of course, the Allosaurus has been safely returned into a card and was recovered by the D team. Yes, you tell him, Terry. This was a beautiful episode. I can't wait to do a part two of the Battle Royale where we have new skins. So yeah, make sure to vote using the poll unit link down below and get your Terry merch at teespring.com slash store slash LP. It goes in, use the code Terry for 20% off. Go give Terry a beautiful congratulations in chat below. And make sure you subscribe, of course, to get notified for a next Dinosaur King meets Rascal Evolution video. With that being said, hope every T-Rex member is going to have a great dinner. I'll see all you lovely T-Rex members in the next episode. Goodbye, Rexes, Alpha Terry out.